Tom, back into FA Cup action this weekend. What are your thoughts ahead of this one? Well, we're looking forward to the game, obviously. Um, we're going to have to look as recently as this time last year to, to know what the FA Cup run um, did for us in terms of the way it moved our season from here to here very, very quickly. So, um, yeah, we haven't gone as well as we wanted to do through, through October in September yet, but I think this is a real uh, opportunity for us to try and you know, get, get ourselves on the up and up, really. Yeah, as you say there, last year that definitely did things for us, didn't it? That FA Cup run kind of lifted the mood and lifted the, well, boosted it around the place. So that's the perfect opportunity to do that again this season, isn't it? Yeah, I think everybody across the country, it doesn't matter what level you're playing at, when you when your team is in the FA Cup, it just brings you know a, a, an air of excitement. You say last year we had a really good run, um, the fans, the players, everybody at the football club enjoyed it, and we're going to try and you know emulate that. At the end of the day, that's what we're trying to do on a weekly basis. Like I said, things haven't gone quite our way in terms of results, but you know there's a lot of the, a lot of each one of our performances, whether we've won, drawn, or lost, um, that I can take positives from. We're a different set of players. And that's, that's a fact. You know, people have got to stop worrying and moaning about things that aren't here. What we've got to do is get behind the lads who are and give them the support that they give the lads who've left. Because ultimately, whilst the player walks on a pitch, as far as I'm the manager of all the short-term football club, he'll be given his all. And, and if his all isn't quite good enough, then he'll be moved on. It's as simple as that. But uh, at this moment in time, I think it's a little bit premature to have made judgments for and against with anybody. Um, but what I will say is, um, come Saturday, I, th- I hope I hope ABB's buzzing. Um, we had a really good crowd last year against Lewis, as it were, um, and this is our first entry into the Cup. Bath have already won a couple of games to get you, so they're not going to be any easy you know, touch. They're perennially in and around the playoffs or in the playoffs in the National South, so they could well, could well be in our league next season. Yeah, I think it's fair to say that every club always looks for a home tie against a team in a lower division in, in the cup competitions. But, you know, I think fans of Aldershot will know in the past that that's not always been the easiest draw, is it? Bath will be coming here with a lot to play for and, and they'll want to prove that, won't they? Yeah, I mean, I was a manager who came here with a lower team and, and won a game. So in my recent history, it happened. I know that. And I know that there was a, it was a, there was a catalogue of of fixtures people want to forget. We don't want to be a statistic of a team going out to a, a team for a, from a lower division. So we give them the same respect as we give every opposition. We do our, do, we do our due diligence um, and we've worked on, on that all week. So yeah, we're looking forward to, to getting the game on now. We've still got a fair few of the group from last year's cut run, haven't we? Have they been talking to a few of the new lads this year to tell them about what can possibly happen? I don't know, but I hope so because these are them are memories that are etched in not just our minds, but they're in the, they're in the history annals. To yeah. be fair, I mean, you know, to, to get what we did to do what we did when we went to Swindon was only one game away from this game. So yeah. you know, let's not let's not be all you know too down about you know what what happened last weekend. It's gone as far as I'm concerned, we've got to move on to this weekend and we, we pick up again on Monday, I'm sure. And we've got the National League Cup, haven't we, next, next midweek yeah. next week. So is this a good opportunity maybe for some of the players to really stake a claim and, and push into your mind and thoughts? Yeah, I mean, look, it's a, it's a cup competition that we ultimately could win, not the FA Cup, the, the, the National <laughs> League Cup. So, you know, as far as I'm concerned, we've got to treat that for what it is. You know, there's a lot of opinion and there's a lot of thoughts being thrown around quite willy-nilly in terms of what people think of it and the reasons for thinking that but they don't know what's actually behind it you know at the end at the end of the day we feel it's a, a competition that's worth us worth us playing in um, and we'll be putting out a team worthy of that you know the, the rules dictate that you have to play a certain amount of players that you did on the Saturday before or the Saturday after um, and and make no bones about it you know playing against young elite athletes, which they'll be from Derby, from Brighton, from, uh, from Southampton, from Fulham, we, we'll have good games, you know, and it can't, can't do us any, uh, anything other than benefit us, really, I don't think. 